Hey YouTube, what's up? And today I'm going to be showing you uh, iOS 4.1 or dot one or whatever you want to call it for the iPhone 4, iPhone 3GS, iPhone 3G, iPod Touch, uh, third generation iPod Touch, second generation I think, and it comes on the iPod Touch fourth generation. So now that we got all that mess out of the way, the nasty mess of what it runs on. Here is um, iOS 4.1. The first thing you'll see is Game Center. This only runs on iPhone 3GS, iPhone 4, and iPod Touch 3rd generation, unfortunately. It does not run on the 3G or iPod Touch 2nd generation. But uh, here is uh, Game Center. Of course, you can follow me on, on Program 90, or friend me on Program 94. I'll, I'll feel free to kick your butts all day long. I don't, I don't feel bad about that. But uh, here's my four friends that I've got here. I'm not really popular yet, but feel free to find me, like I said. Here's the games I have, and I can find more games by tapping there, and it seems to just take you to an Apple page, which is kind of ridiculous. And then I'll go back to Game Center here, and here's my requests, and I can send a request to anybody if I want to, so Steve Jobs or whoever. <laughs> but that's it. Next thing I'm going to do is, uh, I'm gonna, well, it's new here. I have a list here to keep me on track so I don't just go off the off the wall here. Next thing is HDR photos, which is perfect for, I just pulled out the subject I was going to use, but uh, HDR photography, which is really neat, and uh, as you can see up at the top here, there's an HDR button, and you can tap that and turn it on and off, and of course when you turn it on, the flash automatically turns off, so. And here's my magic mouse, and this won't have much of a change because there's not a lot of light difference here, but I'll just show you what it's like taking an HDR photo. I, t I, t I snap it, and there you go. And uh, right, and uh, while it's saving and things, uh, here's a few before and after pictures I'm showing you guys right now here on ScreenFlow, uh, which is a program I use, you know, kind of show you because showing you through this camera is not going to do it justice. And uh, sure, there, there's not a lot of them, and I need to go outside and play with the sun, and this is probably a separate video going over the iPhone 4 camera in a bit more detail. But uh, that's it. Next thing I want to show you is... Uh, iTunes, and uh, you can now rent TV shows. So, I go in here, and uh, here's the video section. What's weird is that I don't actually have any featured shows that you can rent from. It's kind of weird. But if you go to search, and this is Family Guy, it's the only thing I can think of that actually is from Fox. Because that should be from Fox or ABC or Disney. And uh, say, hey, if I tap on uh, Stewie Kills Lois in here, you say I have option to rent, buy, and preview. And that's it. And it's as simple as I can tap rent and um, type in my password and buy it. It's pretty simple. And of course, you have ping, which I've said you can follow me on uh, before. It's uh, kind of nice, I guess. Really don't have much more to say about that other than it's ping. I've gone over a video. Check that out. Uh, you can now upload HD video. I won't. Uh, let's see if I have, I have anything to show you about that. A subject to show you here. Um, uh, yeah, here we go. Here's a video I shot outside. Uh, really neat here. And the best way you go in here, I can send, send to YouTube. And it's probably going to go portrait, so it doesn't matter. And I have an HD option. That only works over Wi-Fi, but uh, it does work. And that also works for mobile me, too. So if you have a mobile me account, you can send that to mobile me. So that in HD. So that works. Just like that. Next thing, uh, like I said, it, it squashes a lot of bugs, uh, the, uh, the proximity sensor issues, some Bluetooth issues people have been having, things like that. Uh, one thing I'll show you here is uh, the new restriction settings, which now, uh, let's see, where is restrictions? Restrictions right here. As you can see, it adds FaceTime there, and uh, if you scroll all the way down, it uh, they have multiplayer gaming in disabled too. Um, uh, Another thing I've added in general is uh, keyboard. You can now turn off check spelling. I'm just going over a few of these because, you know, you, you may not know about these and you may really want to change it. So that's one of the other options. Um, and uh, the last thing is FaceTime. So here is uh, Apple Inc. And I can say FaceTime and it now gives me an email option to FaceTime with. So hopefully Steve Jobs is on his iPod Touch and I can. Uh, FaceTime with them, or I can FaceTime with uh, Apple Apple Support. So that's about it. Or if I hit Add to Favorites, I can also choose say uh, Mobile, and it now gives me an option to add FaceTime. So when I direct tap on it, it just initiates FaceTime call instead of having to worry about wasting minutes with a regular phone call. 
And that is about it. I hope you enjoyed this. Don't forget to thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. And when you subscribe, you're automatically entered to win a $10 iTunes gift card. So don't forget to do that. And I will see you later, YouTube. You have a great day.